we just want to first iterate since it's breast cancer awareness, please, please care about your health. Your breast health is very key. Mm-hmm. Um, please don't dismiss any little thing that you notice that's happening with your body. Yeah. And like Simone just said, she noticed something even with her hair. Even with her hair and her skin. Wow. The back of her neck, the top of her forehead, around her ears. Yeah. And I kept saying, Auntie, you just, it's really dry. Your your hair's not just normally so coarse. the texture of her. Yeah. And in cosmetology, we call it medicine head. I would say to my mom, also who suffered from kidney uh-huh. failure, renal failure. So what's medicine head? It's when you can almost feel that the hair, the porosity of the hair yeah. or the hair texture will not take what you're trying to give it. Wow. From shampoos to conditioners to color wow. to processes from perms and relaxers. It doesn't want to take it. It's like a rejection. There's so much medicine. But sometimes when there's an illness okay. or a diagnosis, okay. that is also present. It's very present wow. in it your changes. taste buds. So you know how they say if you get a diagnosis of cancer, yes. you recognize that, yeah, my food has not been tasting the same. Very true. Uh-huh. So it changes. Cancer changes your metabolic yeah. The way you're made, your yeah. cellular yeah. membrane, it changes you. Wow. So it, your hair, hair is cells, your skin, your yeah. taste bud, yeah. the way you smell. Yeah. Everything changes. And so yeah. the, the one thing about what you said about early detection for women, black and brown women especially, mm-hmm. because we know that the medicines are not designed for us. So 